Today's video regarding HP OfficeJet 8015 all-in-one printer. I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and setup of this printer. This is a wireless printer. You can use it for wireless printing and scanning. So let's start with the unboxing. Once our printer is on, we have to go on the display panel to start the setup process. On the display panel, select the language you want to use for this printer and just confirm it. Select the country of residence. The next thing is to install the setup in cartridges. So just click OK. To install the setup in cartridges, we simply have to take the seals out and make sure you also remove the seals which is here so you just have to do like this now we have to remove this orange cap so you just have to twist it like this and do it for all of these in cartridges to install the setup ink cartridges, we have to open the ink cartridge chamber. So, open the front door. Also, there is a handle here. So, you have to push this upside until it holds itself. And you will see the ink cartridge chamber here in the middle. To install the setup ink cartridges, matches the alphabets and the color. Place it like this, press it down, so it's very easy, so once you place it in the correct position, you have to press it down and it will lock. Now close the ink cartridge chamber door by pressing it down and simply it will lock. Click OK. Load A4 size sheet in the paper tray. Adjust the size. Place the A4 size sheets here. Click on the continue button to do the print head alignment. Next thing is to scan this page on the scanner. So open the torque plate and place it facing downwards on the left hand side corner and click on the scan button. Alignment is successful. Now we can click OK and go for further setup. On the next screen you will see it says get the HP software to do the setup. You can do that or you can just simply skip it and just press this question mark next step is to click on the network setup you can do the wireless setup now or if you want to do it later you can just click on the connect later button click ok so once you click ok you will see the main screen is showing up icons here that means your printer is set up and it's ready for the copy function so from here you can start the copy and if you want to do the scanning and printing you need to set up further again and you can do the wireless setup for that make sure you connect your printer with the wi-fi network and if you do not have a wi-fi network then you can use the printer's inbuilt wi-fi direct so that is the printer's inbuilt wi-fi and add this printer in your device for example laptop computer and macbook and then you can start the wireless printing and scanning for that simply scroll down and click on the wi-fi icon and here you can just click on the yes button and it will start the setup process it will search for the available wireless routers you simply have to select the wireless network you want to connect and 
enter the password from here enter the password and click on the done button and click ok and it will connect with the Wi-Fi network also this printer has a ADF function automatic document feeder tray which you can use for multiple scannings of the pages thanks for watching